Let's start with your reading, Leo. Today, we are going to look into your recent past, current energies, and immediate future. And then we will immediately clarify the messages in order to find out more details about them. Keep in mind that in general readings, energies go both ways. Feel free to interpret the direction of the messages as it best resonate with your own personal situation. All right, let's begin with your reading. Oof. Okay. All right, Leo. The main energy for the reading today is the Page of Cups reversed. Someone is being very hesitant about a situation, potentially about a connection, a love offer, something that could be very emotional, but something that they're not going towards with determination. If you are being this person, then someone is trying to figure you out, Leo, trying to understand if you're doing this because you're not interested or maybe because you need more time. And obviously, the opposite might be true as well. You wanting to connect with this person, but they're being so hard to read that it quickly gets very frustrating. So let's see what's going on here, Leo. In the recent past, King of Cups, Knight of Cups, definitely we see a lot of emotional energy right here. But the first thing that we can see is actually where it all started. This Knight of Cups is coming in with a love offer, as you see right here. Someone is showing interest, flirting, trying to create a connection because they feel very attracted to the other person. They feel this magnetic pull and they're not wanting to waste time playing games. This is someone who was definitely wearing their heart on their sleeve. But given the main energy, I can tell that something did not work out as hoped. And we will see what happened as soon as we start clarifying. In the current energies, we have the Two of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles. Currently, there are actually a lot of things happening, but you might not be able to see it at the moment at all. There are a lot of moving pieces, and I'm inclined to think that the two of you are about to come together. You definitely are. But it's all happening so slowly that you can barely tell. You look out of the window and you barely see anything coming your way. Therefore, you might be thinking that nothing is coming at all, but you are wrong. This person, this connection is tiptoeing back into your life. And before you know it, this might evolve into something big, to something that maybe will surprise you. We'll see what was going on, what is actually going on currently, as soon as we clarify. Now, I mean, look at this. In the immediate future, the world and the Ace of Swords, clarity is the main theme for the future energy. A new beginning that will be created by the fact that someone is now coming in with determination. Very different from the Page of Cups reverse, honestly. And we see how someone is going to reveal their feelings, their intentions, going to say something that will definitely give them away. And so right here, we see the potential for the new beginning, but are the two of you going to be on the same page or is this going to be too late? We'll find out. Now, let's start clarifying and let's begin with your recent past. <laughs> the higher friend, obviously. Judgment. And the Six of Cups, it's definitely clear that someone here really, really opened up. There are expectations built around this. Three of Pentacles, are we on the same page or are we not? Wanting to give love, but also needing to see that love coming back. At first, when we open up, 
we need some sort of validation from the other person in order to keep walking down that path. But something happened here, something that made this Knight of Cups starting to feel very insecure. Something was said or done with the judgment energy. And this really started a domino effect, which ended up in struggle and frustration. The two of you getting farther apart and missing each other at the same time, even if maybe you didn't communicate that to each other. If this was you, Leo, you might have started having a lot of questions. And at some point, the overall excitement for this started fading away. You started giving up on it, not wanting to wait around for the other person to engage in the situation properly. Let's see why the other person didn't immediately go for this. Let's see if we can find the reason into the current energy where we actually see them coming back at a certain degree. So let's keep going and let's clarify the, re the current energy. <laughs> Two of Pentacles, Two of Wands, the Devil, and Eight of Pentacles. I think we can definitely start to see why things haven't worked out the first time around. The Knight of Cups is someone very charming, right? Someone who, uh, someone who comes in with clarity, transparency, someone who doesn't hold back. Whereas the other person's energy seems to be very different uh, with this Knight of Pentacles energy. And overall here with these cards. We see the number two coming up twice and we see the difference in between your approach and potentially also your vision at the, at the beginning. This is someone who in general moves very slowly and it's clear that in the past, the main issue, Leo, was fear of commitment. This person started to play games and to slow things down because at the end of the day, I feel they were not ready for something stable. But obviously, we see a U-turn starting to form here with the Nine of Pentacles. Someone is starting now to rethink their decision. And there is this spark coming back alive, alive on their end. Someone who realizes now more than ever, maybe now for the first time, that they actually really liked you. But someone who at first might have mistaken you for just another option, you know? Well, this Leo is definitely not just another option. And they're slowly realizing that, slowly but consistently. With the devil, we see that day after day, they feel more connected to you than they've ever felt before, even if the two of you are not talking, even if the two of you are not interacting at all. That's how the devil energy behaves. So let's see then what you have coming up. Let's clarify the near future energy. <laughs> the sun, the star and the Page of Cups are upright this time, but at the same time, Queen of Swords. One thing that I see right away is that you're definitely going to stand your ground, Leo. This doesn't mean that you're not interested anymore, but at the same time, you do not want to appear too available. You don't want to appear as though you were waiting for this person to come back with the star energy, you know? Yeah, I was waiting there at the window for you to show up. Oh, no, no, not at all. But at the same time, you want to look into this incoming energy, this page of cups, which now is coming up upright. With this energy, we definitely see a clear message coming in. There is communication that cannot be mistaken for something else. This person is now being very clear, very straightforward. Potentially, they're sending an invite, something that could be a date or some private time together. Someone really feels ready to love, ready to open up right now. 
wanting to do this again, but doing it differently this time and wanting to make it up for have everything that they haven't done or haven't said in the past. And so with the sun and the star, this is actually turning out to be really good. But as far as you go, Leo, I do see this back and forth between the Page of Cups and the Queen of Swords. Not sure what you should do right now. Struggling to connect to your intuition because your heart and your mind are telling you two different things. At first, you were all in, but then their behavior might have created this huge red flag. And right now you are the one who wants to take things lower. So how will this evolve? Let's keep going with the reading and let's focus on the future evolution of this situation. You definitely know that you deserve someone who's going to go out of their way to make it clear that they care about you. Not someone who you have to chase for validation. So how far should you take this leo and what else is coming up for you in the next few months let's keep going with the reading and let's look into these messages if you want to dive deeper into the messages leo just follow me in the extended reading link below in the description box also don't forget that every single week i randomly select viewers who have watched the extended video to offer them a 100 percent free personal live reading I send out emails every Monday morning to confirm. The reading, by the way, is now 45 minutes long, not 30 minutes anymore. It was just not enough time. Make sure to check out your spam folder as well. Sometimes my emails go to my messages, go to the spam folder, and they are seen weeks later. So make sure to check out your spam folder as well. Now, stay tuned for the extended preview coming right up after this. Welcome back to your extended reading, Leo. The bridging energy taking us from this current situation to the incoming events, the Empress. And I am loving this card for you, Leo. First of all, this is the card that talks about loving yourself, feeling confident finally, not feeling unstable and overall out of your own element, feeling in control of the situation and also of how how you act in it, which is also very, very important. But also what we see here is something that becomes official, something that changes its state, you know? Going from being very up in the air to become something more concrete on which to build. Does this talk about a new beginning together or does this talk about a new beginning apart? Something new starts for you right here, and I'm glad to see that it's supported by the Page of Cups coming up right. Two of Pentacles, again, very important. Someone now is working hard to make you happy, to see that beautiful smile on your face. And obviously, looking at this Ace of Wands, the spark is back on their end. What about on your end, Leo? Let's see what this person is bringing to the table now. And also let's see if this is something that you should even focus on. Or if maybe, you know, this person is a little wishy-washy and it's best for you to uh, move on. What is this about? Let's look into it and let's see what else is coming your way in the next few months, Leo. Let's start by clarifying again this page of cups down here and let's see what this person is about now that they are revealing themselves. <laughs> Knight of Pentacles wants to come up again. Two aces right here and look what we have here. The Hierophant once again, but this time it's not coming from you. This time it's coming from this person and this is why. Thank you.